Hey guys, we got VBAD Day 24, and uh, something quite awesome happened today. Um, the contacts arrived. So, uh, I guess this will be checking them out, see what's going on with them, and uh, maybe I'll do the actual whole video blog with them in. But um, here they are. They're eye candy. Of course, they're made in Korea, so hopefully I won't die the moment I put them in my face. But as you can see, they're called the Yellow Out. And um, it comes with this cute little contact lens case, which, you know, whatever. I, yeah, I, I have contacts. I wear them normally, so I was actually able to get these in my prescription. Um, it's a toric lens. But, you know, hey... It works, so we'll soon find out or whatever. So I'm going to try them out, and then there'll be more video. Howdy, everybody. So you saw the first bit of video from my iPhone. I don't know why my iPhone is so jacked. But, um, yeah, it's kind of hard to do that. Never mind. But this is what they look like with them in. It is kind of freaky. I like the way it looks. I think with the costume, it's going to work very well. Um, I got these from... Turtle Lenses, TurtleContacts.com. I think it was Turtle Lenses. Um, check either one of them out, or there'll be a link down there. I'll check it and be sure as to which one. Um, these are in my prescription, which is pretty cool, so I can see out of them. Once they settle on your eye, there's almost no obstruction of vision. The pupil is a little small, so, you know, like in darker rooms where your pupil would get a little larger... Uh, you will get some tunnel vision a little bit where, like, you know, everything kind of has this yellow halo around it. But it's actually kind of cool. It doesn't bother me really at all. But they are, once they settle on my eyes, uh, or now that they have settled on my eyes, they are quite comfortable. Um, I'm looking at my eyes, and my left eye is always the more difficult one to get a contact lens into for some reason. Um, so that one's a little red for me trying over and over and over again. But all in all, I like the way they look. I like the way, you know, it almost blends in with my natural skin tone. Like as I'm looking, it's, you know, it looks freaky because, you know, I'm not white <laughs> or an albino. So having any kind of light eyes looks a little freaky. But, um, my skin is yellow enough. I mean, you know, like I'm brown up here, but I'm yellow down here. And um, there's enough yellow in my skin that the eyes kind of blend in. So, it, you know, and the color on my camera is not the best, but yeah, you can see how they look and that's that. My video blog, I did a reply to um, one of the gay, one of the questions from Gaze of the Week and I did a video reply to it. You guys should be able to find it on the page. And um it got liked. It got not liked just by anyone. It got liked by Ryan. I'm so excited because, I mean, really, you know, it kind of means, I guess, whatever I had to say had some kind of substance to it. You know, whatever kind of fuckery that was, it came out. But um, it's just kind of like, wow, someone who's well known on YouTube has has viewed my... It's, it's kind of like being... It's kind of like if you have... I don't know, something that you do, something that you're enjoying doing and having someone else who's done it for a very long time, who's very well established, kind of recognize and say, hey, yeah, that, that was kind of cool. You know, that's you know, that's what it's like. So that's one thing I, you know, that video got on there. I'll put a link down to it down below um, so that way you guys can check it out. The question was, you know, how do, what do you think about gays who vote for Mitt Romney? And I just kind of gave my reply to that, which was a very interesting one. I didn't have to swallow any souls for it. So it's a good thing. Um, and I'm happy that I was able to, you know, get put up and get seen. Now, you know, it's like, wow. Hopefully this just means that more people will see me and get to see the videos. And, you know, hey, I want in on Gaze of the Week. I'm not even going to lie. I want in on that. So... Yeah, that's that. And the other is horror movies. Oh my God, what is your favorite horror movie? I have been inundating myself with horror movies for the past week or so because I love horror anyway, any time of year. But during Halloween, it's my favorite time of year, favorite holiday. And I'm just 
uh, there's horror all over the place. And I just bought the Paranormal Activity trilogy, which is now not so much a trilogy because of part four. But I had seen the one, I saw two, but I'd never seen three. And I don't own any of them. So I was like, okay, I downloaded those three. I've watched all three of them. It's pretty good. I am excited to see what's going to happen in part four. Um, I know that four has been out for, you know, a bit now, really. I mean, in terms of movie time, yeah. I'm not an opening weekend kind of guy, because if I do opening weekend, I do end up swallowing a soul or two, and that is just not good. So I tend to wait a week or so before I go see. So I'm, I'm planning on seeing it next week. Um, no spoilers, please. Thank you. And right now, I just happen to be watching Freddy vs. Jason. I am working from home again which I love. I love the ability to do this, to be able to work from home. Um, it's actually one of the biggest perks of my job. But yeah, my lunch break here, I just got Freddy vs. Jason going and I'm enjoying that. But what is your favorite horror movie? If I had to pick a favorite, a favorite favorite, it has to be The First Nightmare on Elm Street. I mean, it was so cerebral. I mean, you know, if you sit there and just watch it, it can be dumb fun. But if you actually sit there and think about some of the things that are actually being said, you know, the loss of innocence of youth and stuff like that, it's a it's it's a mind fuck. It's a really good movie and it stands the test of time. And, you know, who doesn't enjoy seeing Johnny Depp before Tim Burton got his hands on him? I mean, come on. That's pretty cool. So that's one that's my favorite. Uh what's your favorite? Go ahead and reply down below. You can Send a, you know, a video reply. Don't forget to like. Don't forget to share and all that other great stuff. Don't forget to subscribe up above and uh, check me out. You can follow me on Twitter at LinksBear. You can find me on Facebook, uh, Brutal Links Bear, And you can also check out the blog, which is BrutalLinks.com. So, yeah, these are the eyes for Linksifer. Linksifer is going to be quite the incubus. He wants to swallow your soul and anything else you got for him. You guys have a good one. And yeah, wow, VBAD, day 24, coming to a close. We're getting close. <laughs>